In 2004, my wife and I set up our company in Gleinstadt with just one truck, which we drove ourselves until 2008, the year in which we purchased another vehicle and took on our first employee. From that moment on, the company underwent continuous growth until 2015, which is why that year we acquired a second premises in the Grobs area, the city where our registered office is currently located. As of today, we have a staff of 43 and a fleet of 37 trucks. Contacts with Kogler began in September 2008 for a Fosse 800 RA. Our first crane, purchased in record time and went into service in February of the following year, had a lifting capacity of 80 ton meter and marked the beginning of a rewarding collaboration with Kogler and Fosse Cranes. Up until a certain point, the company fleet was made up exclusively of up to 80 ton meter cranes, meaning that we were forced to subcontract for jobs which required a higher extension or greater lifting capacity. This is why we opted for a Fosse 2150 RAL crane. First and foremost, I would say the 23 ton meter Fosse models, which are fundamental for transportation operations and the handling of specific materials for construction. The bucket function is also very much in demand. Furthermore, we cannot do without the Fosse 365 cranes, which are extremely useful for roofing projects and processing of steel and sheet metal. Lastly, with regard to installation works, cranes with lifting capacities of 50 and 80 ton meter play a very important role. Precision and the trusting relationship we've built with our clients, values that represent the foundation we laid together in 2008 with our first employee, and which we still carry forward with all of our staff in order to guarantee the highest levels of client satisfaction. Kogler Cron Technique support and the vehicles fitted with Fosse cranes are two important factors. Work on sites does not always proceed as planned. But we know that in the case of any unforeseen problems, we can count on the speed of the technical support, which allows us to reduce downtime to a minimum so that work can continue as quickly as possible.